Well, it's a beautiful day out here at the Madrona Passive House. Gorgeous sunshine on a sunny October day. Perfect day for a pour. Um, and we've got a whole lot of concrete going in. So this is the, the, this is the structural slab that's going on top of the grade beams and the uh, pilings. Uh, this, this slope has historical movement. So um, we have to essentially separate the foundation from the soils that are immediately below it. So that was the, that was the reason for all the pilings and the grade beam combining the pilings and our structural slab. So we have essentially built a platform from which we are now going to build a passive house. So this platform we have here is going to be there. We now can build on top of it. On top of this structural slab, we're gonna put five and a half inches of foam and there's gonna be a structural retaining wall zigzagging on the back side of the hill here. We're gonna insulate on the inside of that. So we're building our thermal envelope inside the structure that is connecting this building to the soils. It has created a few unique uh, structural details um, throughout the building, which we'll be seeing in the framing phases and then later at the insulation phases. But at this point, we now have something on which we can build a passive house.